when Jesus inaugurated his mission, he made it a universal mission, not a mission that was restricted to only a few. His mission was not parochial. His mission was not narrow-minded. His mission was not only for the intelligent or the intellectual. As a matter of fact, the fact that Jesus used parables or stories to communicate messages about the kingdom of God is an indication very clearly that he wanted to reach out to the poorest of the poor, including the unlettered, those who could neither read nor write. In the gospel text of today, he explicates in words once again that this is true about his mission when he brings in the analogy of the lamp. When a person switches on the tube light in today's world, and in those days it was a lamp, the lamp was brought into the room, the lamp gives light to the whole room, the tube light enlightens the whole place. That is what Jesus has come to do. He has not come to give some esoteric or secret teaching. He has not come to give a teaching which can be only understood by a person who can think great thoughts. His thoughts, his words are down to earth. His thoughts and his words are practical because his thought and his words are the words of God. And the word of God is very simple. The word of God is very undiluted. The word of God simply says, I love you. And this is the message in the gospel text of today. Jesus loves all without distinction. Like a lamp gives light to the whole room, like the tube light gives light to the whole room, so Jesus gives light and love to anyone who wants to accept it with an open heart. Will you, like Jesus, be light, life and love to at least one person today?